Hey there, Karma. Before the video starts, don't forget to click that subscribe button and click that small little bell on the side to get notified every time I upload. Anyways, hope you guys enjoyed the video! What a mess. I can't believe this was all done by two vampires. How's her eye, Doctor? Well, I'm afraid she won't be able to see out of it again. I've treated the injury as best I could. Thank you, Doctor. No. Thank you for protecting us. We didn't really do anything. You did enough. Because of you, some people still get to see their families. He's right, we can't save everyone, but we did what we could, and that's all we can do. I guess. Sir. Sir! How is Investigator Oma? I'm sorry, but... Investigator Oma is no longer with us. No. No way. But how?! It appears he was stabbed. Most likely by the vampire he was reported fighting. <sighs> that bastard! I'll kill him! If he shows his face again, I'll make him pay! Investigator Oma was a brilliant man. He went out of his way to save his students from a threat far greater than anyone has faced. Those people... Wait, what happened to their friends? One of them suffered major injuries from the fall. However, the green-haired boy explained that she died at the hands of a different vampire shortly after. The red-hooded boy. From what he told us, his friend was a vampire, pretending to be a human this whole time. Sir, there's no sign of the target. No data can be recovered on his computer, sir. We'll search the whole area for any hints or leads on his whereabouts. Very well, officer. Please do your best. Honestly, I highly doubt he's left anything behind.
What now? We've been promoted to rank two investigators. We've been put on hold for the investigation on the Bloodhound. His trail went cold. No! I meant... what now? Without Investigator Oma. Oma would have wanted us to keep moving forward with our lives. I know that! It's just... it all happened so quickly. If only we didn't abandon him on that floor! Levi, he would have wanted us to go. As investigators, it's our job to protect those who can't fend for themselves. That's what Oma did. Sir, this is for you. I hope it helps. Here, kid. Use this wisely. And make sure you don't lose it. Always knew how to look out for others, huh? Old man. Let's keep moving forward. Yeah. Any updates? No signs of the missing vampire. I just don't understand what the green haired fellow is talking about. A friend of theirs was a vampire? A childhood friend at that too? We've never heard of any cases like these. I've been reading the files on this boy. We've accumulated all data on him and he's appeared to be a normal human being. Blood tests showed normal human blood cells in his records. Then how does that explain him running away from his apartment? If we follow up with his college records, he dropped out recently and hasn't showed up to college ever since. Until the incident. I see. Something happened to him in between those times. During those times was when the FFC had a break in one of our vaults. A classified item was stolen by a vampire. You don't think it could have something to do with that? Hmm, perhaps. We're going to have to keep our eyes open for any more leads. For now, that should be all. Understood, sir. Alright, students, I am Associate Class Investigator Dante. I will be one of your supervisors for your intensive investigator internship. At times like these, we are in dire need for more investigators, so I hope and wish for the best of both of you. I look forward to working with you both. We, we look, look forward, forward to, to working, working with, with you, sir! sir. So... Are you going to talk? Hmm? You haven't really talked much ever since. I know, Zell. You don't have to mention it. <laughs> All right. Why? Hmm? Why did you tell him to go away? Do you blame him? Do you hate him? Do you think it was his fault? Shut up. What? He had every chance to tell us. 
He kept it from us and put us in so much danger. He could have just kept avoiding us. And then what? You'd keep resenting him for not talking to us ever. And we could have been better off that way! I know! This is disgusting to say, but I can't accept it! She's dead! Aura is gone! I can't accept that, Nia! If only we were stronger! I, I keep trying to find an excuse or, or something to blame, but deep down I know it's because we were weak! I was weak! I couldn't do a goddamn thing! I'm so sorry, Zell. far Come on, there's the culprit. Look. Target confirmed, sir. Good job. Ugh, he looks like a mess. He might be from the hospital. Shit, I have to get out of here. <coughs> Let's bring him in. I have... I have to run. <coughs> wow, how pitiful. You vampires always taking whatever you can with no remorse or anything. I'M SICK OF IT! You all are just ANIMALS! You're the reason why we have to fight! You're the reason why so many have lost their families! You're the reason why the world is so screwed up! You say we take, but we aren't the only ones at fault here. We all live in this messed up world, all trying to survive its harsh conditions that were given to us. But there's always a choice. That's what I learned, and I choose... Not to kill. Shut up, you bastard! Don't make me laugh! What the? Ugh. Ah. I used up so much strength.
did you find me? I found out about the hospital incident, so I rushed to find you. Yeah, well, my friend died because of me. I wasn't strong enough. I did what you told me not to do. I approached him and I endangered them and now I got one of them killed! And now I... I... Why? Why me? I never asked for this. I never wanted this. Oh, no. Huh? I never told you my name. I always knew. Allow me to introduce myself. My name is Crystal Orisu Malvolia, daughter of the second progenitor of the Vampire Reign. Crystal, you... you... you were a vampire all this time? Yeah. There is a lot to be explained. You... you... Agno. There's somewhere I want to bring you. Do you trust me? I, I don't understand. Kagano, I know there's a lot to be explained, but right here and now, I need you to listen to me as your friend. At that point, I honestly didn't know what to do. I just followed my instincts and took her hand, hoping that I could find salvation with this vampire curse. <laughs> 